And you knew at six, before you head to the store to restock on some of your favorite cheeses, you might want to be prepared for sticker shock. News 9's Victoria Saha joining us from Marshfield. Cheese prices are at a record high. Folks here at Nasonville Dairy are doing their best to keep up with consumer demand every day. Munching on some cheese always sounds like a good idea, but prices are taking a sharp turn here in America's Dairyland. The biggest thing is how do you adjust to anything this quickly? You know, both directions, down or up, how do you adjust? Because the stores don't get a chance to adjust, the restaurants didn't get a chance to adjust, and the consumer hasn't had a chance to adjust to it. So we're trying to feather our way through it. And now that restaurants are opening up again, the demand has increased. We've got restaurants looking for that sliced and shredded uh, cheddar. You've got uh, people at home wanting that shredded product. So everyone's looking for cheddar right now. These prices right now are escalating and, and they're bouncing so fast that neither side Nobody can adjust to them. So how much of a price difference are we talking about? Back in April, a pound of cheese like this was a dollar, the lowest it's been since 1977. And managers at Nasonville Dairy say that now in June, a block of cheddar like this is at $2.70 per pound. But even before the lockdown lifted, grocery stores were seeing more consumers wanting cheese. They saw a 70% surge because more people had to buy at home. They had to eat at home. They had to make their food at home. So that was the first thing. They're still running 20 and 30% ahead. Restaurants, the white tablecloth especially, but all restaurants are down about 80% yet. Here at Nasonville Dairy, they're shipping out 165,000 pounds of cheese a day. 630 different kinds of cheese here. And so we need to, you know, we need to adjust, but we need to make you know, make money at to keep reinvesting. With Wisconsin's love for cheese, he expects people to continue wanting to buy no matter what the price. As far as how long the price increase will stick around, the managers here say it could be anywhere between six to 18 months. In Marshfield, Victoria Saha, News 9, WAOW.